San Antonio getting ready for the final holiday of the winter season, New Year's Eve. But along with the fun comes an increased risk of landing yourself in the ER. Eyewitness News reporter Jeremy Baker shows us how to stay safe and stay alive this New Year's holiday. New Year's Eve can be fun, but it can also be dangerous, especially for the little ones. I would recommend not taking infants to where firecrackers are going to be launched. The younger a child is, the more likely they can have some hearing injuries. The National Council on Firework Safety say sparklers are responsible for about 16% of legal firework injuries nationwide. Half of those are children under the age of five, and that red tip on the sparkler can be as hot as 1,500 degrees Fahrenheit. Never, ever let young toddlers and children under the age of eight even light fireworks or crack, firecrackers by themselves. They need to be supervised. Older kids end up in the ER too. Launching them in their hand, using bottle rockets in ways that they weren't designed to be. Then there's drunk driving. And underage drinking and driving. We're very concerned about that during this New Year holiday period. Safe Auto says the 12 hour window between 6 p.m. New Year's Eve and 6 a.m. New Year's Day sees a jump of about 71% in crashes involving alcohol or drugs. About 150 to 200 people will die in auto accidents New Year's Day, making it the second deadliest day to be on the road, only behind Thanksgiving Eve. The internet is covered with another holiday hazard, champagne cork mishaps. Some even on purpose. A cork to the eye is blunt trauma to the eye, and you can get a hyphema, which is blood in the anterior chamber, or worse. The safest way to open champagne is over a sink with a towel over top of the bottle so that cork doesn't go flying. I'll be working here on New Year's Day. I don't want to see you in the ER. Jeremy Baker, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News. And a reminder, shooting fireworks in the city limits is illegal. SAFD's illegal fireworks hotline opens tomorrow evening. Number to call 207-0202. If caught popping fireworks within city limits, you could face a fine of up to $2,000. The hotline will remain open until 1230 a.m. Wednesday.